Oh, you can just feel the electricity here in this one. Can't wait for this. Hi, everybody. I'm James Sabalski, along with Ray Ferraro and Carlin Bade. It's time to drop the puck. Both teams seem ready, and they are about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. The Generals start with possession as we are now underway. Grabs control of it at the point. Denies them in close. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We've still got zeros on the board. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Moves the puck. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. The Generals are off to the box. Interference the call. to the ice. It's our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. Well, to this point, the game is scoreless, and now you've got a real great opportunity with your power play on the ice to get on the board first. That first goal is so critical. Make the opponent chase the game. Quebec City's got him along the wall. Stops the rocket of a shot. Puck scooped up by Bones. Puts it on net, and that's deflected off someone in front. He grabs the puck here at the point. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Here's a chance! Oh, and he didn't get all of it, but just enough to keep it out of the net. Good save. Positional save through traffic. The Wildcats have it against the wall. Toronto's penalty killers get their man out of the box. Close save! Oh, goalies love this. I mean, he gets to flash the leather. The glove save and the little snap of the wrist to show everyone in the building. Nice try. I've got it. Toronto's won the face off deep in their own end. Scooped up along the wall by Ho. And he moves the puck back inside his own end. The Wildcats looking against the half wall. Oh, wow, that had some hot sauce on that collision. Did it ever, James. I mean, you could see he was raring to get a hit in to try and change a little bit of the momentum, and the shoulder went into the player. That's a solid, clean hit. Oh, you got to love the effort as he blocks that. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Quick feed to Marchand. Oh, there was some TNT with that collision there. Yeah, that wasn't just going to rub somebody out of the plate. He's known for this. If he's got an opportunity to blow somebody up, he's going to do it. That was a big hit. And he lowers the boom there. Handles the puck. Takes the feed. Sends a pass over. To the paint. Can't make it work. Made the save on the play. As he slides in the butterfly, he's in great shape to make this save. Quick pass to Ho. Puck picked up in the open ice. From the open ice, they gain the line. Centering key. He scores! What a goal! Man, these wheelhouse one-timers, man, you just watch the puck explode off the stick on the one-timer. This is a special skill. Here in the back half of this period, the Generals have taken a 1-0 lead. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Moves it to the middle. Oh, and he couldn't 
connect on the play. Hangs on to the puck. The Wildcats have it from the corner. Comes up with a scores! And look who it is! His first goal with his new EASHL team. The excitement that he displays when that puck goes into the net, you know how much this means. You will never forget your first goal. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Throws it in. The Wildcats have it behind the net. Handles the pass from the right side. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. It's a chance on the rush. Two on one. Denied by the goaltender. When he gets the puck, the goalie better be sharp. He's known to create space, get around defenders with his moves, and then shoot the puck quickly. Picked up along the wall by Marchand. Sends it down low. Chance in front. Great defensive heads up play to pick it off. Angles it over to Marchand. Oh, what a collision with that hit. Known for this, he doesn't make any mistake. There's the opportunity to lay a body check out, and he's right on it. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Makes the save. I think he got a foot on that one. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Here in the late going of the frame, we are all tied up in this one. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Picked up along the boards by Marchand. And that goes off course off of Bonnie. Centering feed. Oh, and he just couldn't properly connect with that shot. Moves it to the middle. Takes the blast. And that caroms off a body in the lane. And that slides right out to center ice. There's the horn ending the first period. Both teams will have a chance to regroup. You do you. And we'll be back with period number two in a moment. Fans back in their seats. Teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Neither side giving up much in the opening frame. And here we go. Still tied up in the second. Sends it over to Marchand. Another big hit. Man, this guy has one color on his mind, and it's the other team's jersey. Skate, hit, skate, hit. It's been that all night. Some good stick work to force that turnover. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Solid hit on the play. Spooner's got the puck in his own zone. Stretch pass. Passes it to Hogue. Man, James, we're feeling that up here. What a solid body check delivered there. He's known for this, and he doesn't miss this opportunity. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Moves the puck behind the net. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Looking to set up offensively. Oh, what a pass! Hey, James, just jumping in for a second. That was an enormous hit. And now he moves it to home. And that's just out of reach. Into the offensive zone down the right wing. Here's a chance in front. And that's intercepted. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Here's a short pass to Hogue. Moves the puck down low. 
From the point, they take control of it. And now he angles it across to Paco. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Generals win the draw. Scores! An absolute clutch finish puts them ahead. It's felt like there was going to be a go-ahead goal pretty quickly here. There it is. That's a nice finish, and it's on the board. I'd say that's a pretty effective screen. You can see by the goaltender reacting, James. He doesn't really pick it up. He's trying to guess at it where the puck might be. The Generals win the faceoff. Paco's taking it from his own end. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. The Generals have it from their own end. From the right side, moves it up ahead. Centering Cage! He scores! What a play! Toronto's put themselves in the driver's seat on the back nine of this game here, Ray. They're, they've been impressive so far tonight. They have been, and nothing should change from their perspective. They have to be ready. I'm sure their opponents are going to put together a pretty strong push. Takes the feed. The Generals gain control of the puck against the wall. And now it's over to Hogue. Can't find his man. Nice zone entry from the left. Oh, you are saving a beauty on the play. Get that swap out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. There's a save. We see goaltenders in this butterfly practicing it every day. Positioning, keeping their arms tight, making sure that they stay in the center of the puck. The Generals carry it along the wall. Toronto sliding the puck behind the net. The Generals will play it against the wall. And that goes off a player in front. Grabs the puck here at the blue line. Bones oh, is hobbling around on the ice and not feeling right. He's got to get to the bench and try and get his breath here. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. The Generals have it now. Holmes gained the line and on the attack. Quebec City's got the puck here in the open ice. Oh, fantastic stop there. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Holmes got it behind his own net. Inside his own end moves the puck. And the middle frame almost done. Nice feed. Skates in behind the cage. Here comes the call. The Wildcats are going to be shorthanded as they are called for tripping. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Denied that one. And there's the horn, two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next.
Been a great night for hockey so far. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Let's drop the puck on this third period. Toronto's won the opening draw, and their power play rolls on. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Here's a shot. There it is! Power play goal in the back of the net. Just shovel that puck to the net. It's the first play here. And the second part is it gets deflected somewhere out front. The bunch of players lingering around. The goalie can't find it. And it's in the net. Toronto's lamp lighting performance continues here with another goal in the third. They can walk home. They have dominated this third period. They've stretched the lead out into a really comfortable margin. And that's broken up. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Lots of time left in this period. Toronto's got a three-goal lead. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And that pass goes awry. Bones works the puck in his own zone. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Works it across to Marchand. Oh, he just got hit oh. by a freight train. This has to seem like rush hour to him. He can't get from one end of the ice to the other without getting run over. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. That's not going to fool him. Shooting that snapshot while you're on the move is a real difficult thing for the goalie to keep up to. As you're moving, you're changing the angle with every try. Stayed by the goaltender. No. Stayed with it on the redirect. The Wildcats will play it in their own end. Intercepts the net center. Stays with it. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. From the top of the offensive zone here. Puck is frozen and we get a stoppage in play. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Toronto's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. Toronto's got the puck. The Generals in transition at center. Oh, tremendous athletic reflexes there with the toe stop. Centers are set. Face off ready to resume play. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Cutting to the front of the net. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Into the butterfly, slides across to make the save. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Oh, hello! What a collision! Nah, that's not a collision. That's one player delivering a solid body check to another. He's known for this. If you have your head down for just a second, look out. Tries to slide, but uh -oh, no convert. dice. No dice, man. Not happening on the play. Good stand-up hit on the play. Oh, look at this. They're outnumbered here. It's a three-on-one. The Generals will play it from the defensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to Marchand. The turnover. Here they come. Can't connect. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Holmes got it against the boards. Gives them a jolt with that hit. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. And there we go, icing is the call. More than half the period has expired. A lot of offense in this one, mostly from one side. We've got 4 1 the score. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Some great thievery in the open ice. Takes the shot. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? Oh, 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 oh. 
Just here in the late stages of this frame, Toronto's been the better team, and the scoreboard shows it. 4-1 is where we sit. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Here's a centering pass, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Gives him a tap with a stick, and the referees don't like it. Let's get the official decision. Hey, this was one of my favorites, James. The old slashing penalty. It took a few of those in the day. Another chance here on the man advantage. You can't just shoot the puck and think you're going to beat the goalie cleanly all the time. I think this power play will be more effective, James, if they can get traffic in front. And not much on that one. Strong fundamental save there. You make the save, you get it to the corner. That's puck control. Pass out front! Yes! What a finish on the play! Guys, this is a huge moment for this player. It's his first career goal in the EASHL. You know one of the trainers is going to grab that puck, tape it up, and leave it in that locker stall. And a good heads-up defensive play in the open ice. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Fails to find the open man. Pokes the puck away. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Oh, what's the word I'm looking for in that? The sorest. Oh, you got it. Truculence? Yeah, I know you were ready to fire that up. That is a big hit. And I knew you were digging for that one. Great heads up play with the stick by Bones. Quebec City's oh, in possession yeah. along the boards. And sends it just out of reach. Oh, what a stop on the play! Here in the late goings of the period, Quebec City still behind the eight balls. They trail by two goals. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Sends it in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. We got a whistle as the puck's closing. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. He got all of that one. Picks up the puck at his own end. Pass in front. Oh, what a chance. And he fanned on the puck. And the defenders come up with the puck. That's all she wrote from this one. The Generals win this one, and a night it seemed as though the puck was on a string for them. They had it the whole time and really looked like they were going to dominate the game because they had the puck so often. However, it was tight, and they did a good job to hang on. That'll do it for tonight's broadcast. For Ray, Carlin, I'm James. See you next time.